Hey guys, BK Bossman here, and today I have a quick tutorial on how to get the new slender maps such as Sanatorium, uh, Elementary, High Spice, and Mansion. Um, what you're going to need are, to start at least, is three things. First, first thing you want to get, wind zip. I'll leave a link in the description below for that. And you're going to need to make two folders. Name one of them Slender Games and one of them new folder just leave the name like that and if you don't know how to make a new folder on your desktop just right click go to new new and then folder and then one will come up all right I'm gonna delete that because I don't need it all right first step is what you want to do go to the link right here it'll be in the description below and it will be labeled maps go to it's gonna be slendermanshadow.com so it's once you click on that link it will bring you to this uh, website right here as you can see we just reached hundred and fifty dollars and we're almost to I think it says th it says 30 so they are making a new map right now uh, it's being made we just reached hundred and fifty dollars last night so that's great another maps coming and that's it. all right now once you're here you're gonna click on any of these maps you want and make sure when you hit download right before you want to hover over it and make sure words come up like what you want to download here nothing comes up go down no download sanatorium comes up that's what you want so click on it make sure nothing comes up nothing comes up sanatorium that's what you want you want that the download will start right here for uh, Google Chrome users for Mozilla Firefox it will show up in a separate window on your screen and Internet Explorer I have no idea because I don't use it let's see it's right here it's starting to download I am not going I'm gonna cancel it because I already have it once it's done downloading you're either gonna click on the download right there but I am going to go to my downloads right here you go to downloads and then you scroll down until you find your map right here then you're gonna once you have, since you have WinZip you'll just open it double click it and it will open in WinZip and you're gonna have all these files here now right now they don't work because they're not extracted so you're gonna left click on your WinZip file right click and then extract and you're gonna go to desktop and find your Slender Games folder right there you're gonna left click on it once and then hit unzip it will start extracting and you should have in your slender games folder it should not be empty anymore it should have your map in it now note right here you you need one of these folders for every map you have do not put all the maps in one folder you're gonna need see I have a folder separate for regular slender then you're gonna need a folder for sanatorium a folder for hospice a folder for elementary and so on and so forth all of that otherwise your latest one will just be the dominant one and which say I click on sanatorium I have hospice in here hospice will open I did that wrong and I have to fix it right after this tutorial so I can play so once you have your game and everything extracted in this folder the game is downloaded installed properly and you're done that part now you have one more step so what you're gonna do next is you're gonna go to this link right here a microsoft.com link that'll be in the description below also and you're just gonna put that in real quick and it's it once you get onto it it will be an automatic download it'll start downloading right away which is why the web page will take a little bit longer than normal because it also has to work it also has to prepare the download to be downloaded because you just don't hit click a button that says download but I've actually done this tutorial a few times before and it's failed because of the quality is horrible so I finally just got hypercam and it looks like it's doing good so far but as you can see the download started automatically right down here direct X June 2010 Redis that's what you want all right you're gonna minimize this go to your downloads find your direct X mine's right here you're gonna open it run yes and then you're gonna come to this window you can exit this now you're gonna go to browse and find your desktop 
So I'm going to go right up here to Ian, the Ian folder, user folder, desktop, and click just left click and highlight new folder right there and then click OK. I'm going to hit cancel because I already have it extracted and I don't want to do it again or else it can get ruined. Now it'll start extracting. Once you hit OK, when you find the folder you want, it's going to start extracting right here. And once it's done extracting, you're going to hit OK again or it's just going to go away by itself. And then once you have it extracted, all of these files, months and years, will be in this folder. You're going to scroll down until you see DX Setup, which is the setup for DirectX. You're going to do this very simple, not, not a hard installation at all, just like a normal anything you would download installation. Follow the steps. Click when, yes when you have to click yes, no when you know. Very simple. Then hit finish, and then you're done. You have the maps. As I said, very simple many steps not many steps I mean um, so then you're gonna drag your folders wherever you want on your desktop do not delete your DirectX folder off your desktop or it can ruin the game file so then you're gonna drag these wherever open your desktop up a little bit and then as you can see you're gonna open it up it's gonna click yes it'll come up start loading down here you're gonna have a launch button come up right here and an exit button if you click launch and it does not launch in about 10 seconds you did something wrong and that's when you should either comment below PM me on YouTube right here or you can go to ageofgaming.net and message me on there my username on there is the same as on here as you can probably tell and if it does if you did it right it should launch in under 10 seconds not very long at all so Alright guys, that's it. I hope this tutorial helped you. I did this just because I was having trouble with it and I've had some questions about it. So I just wanted to clarify everything with everybody. Well guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Again, I hope this helped. Peace.